Hey, this is your boy Mario Bell coming to you one more time with Cut for Life 36, where we go over cuts and life. Weekend news, we want to have a recap on the George Zimmerman case. He was free. America, he was freed. They placed a million dollar bond for Mr. Zimmerman. Cuss for life, tell me, what is the problem? Somebody is backing him. I want you to do your homework. Find out who's sending him money. He killed him. He should be in jail. He lied. So, hey, the book is not closed. Let's be vigilant about this cuss for life. Peace. My name is Michael Bell. I'm with Bell Protection. What we provide is that protection and security. I can be reached at 770-873-3106. That's 770-873-3106. And if you call me and said you heard the bell, I offer 10% discount. By the way, you can also email me at sgtbell -L at bellsouth.net. Sam Jack. Yeah. Sam Jack. Yeah. 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 Hey. I'm in my B Boy stand. I'm in my B Boy stand. I'm in my. Hey, we doing another segment. Real South. Real South. 808 on the beat. Right here, man. What it is, C Long? This is your boy D Bills coming at you live. One more game of Cuts for Life 36. And I am your host, D. Bilzer. And, uh, well, we got our runner in the building. One of my partners. You know what I mean? What's up, our runner? What's going on with you, D. Bilzer? Man, you all right? Hey. Man, man, tell me a little bit about yourself, man. What's going on with you? Oh, uh, man, ain't nothing too much. Just work for you. Uh, work, work every day. Work, work every day. Working on a little mix CD. I know you, you got most of the time, man. No? Yeah, working on a couple tracks. Yo, let me get who working up. Yeah. Working on some movies. I'm supposed to be working on everything, man. Hey, let it roll with that. Let it roll with that. So, uh, what's going on? Got you into the feeling, man. You do all this, we multi talent you do, man. Somebody gotta put this good music out of here. Yeah, I know they got these cats ain't done, man. Yeah, a lot of music out there bogus right now, man. A lot of, a lot of bogus music right now. Yeah, so what, what you what you bring to the table, man? Tell me about your style, man. Your flavor, your flavor. Tell me what they tell me on that. Uh, me, man, you know, me, I'm just a little, I'm a little around, I'm touch all the bases, you know. I'm in different areas, you know. My bad and was born, bred, and you know what I'm saying? Moved to a lot of Yo, yo, so I love it, I love it, you know, Baton Rouge Square and this ATL shit, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's a combination, though. Yeah, we're a caveman. Yeah, yeah, so, just do my thing with music, man, bring the best of both worlds, you know what I'm saying? So, I do my own, uh, can't have production, you know, fuck with other cats too, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Uh, that's lit, man, working on Duffin' and Little Mix CD, got music. Got music, got music, man. Got music, man. Drop that sometime in September. Gonna drop that video shoot. Just yeah. went well, you know, including yourself. Yeah, what, what, what's up with that, man? What a video. Working on that, man. That's getting worked up right now. In the editing room, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's video. That's gonna be hot right now, man. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know all that, girl. You got some good size out of that thing, man. Yeah, yeah, you gonna do it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's how it's gonna be set, man. Hey, hey. hey. <laughs> you know, everybody help make that video set, you know. It's coming through. It's coming through. We're gonna put it online. We got some probably within the next week. And uh, just basically flood the channel. Flood the channel. Right. Video. Yeah, every day. Yo, so what kind of advice you give out to catch like your son? You know what I'm saying? Like me, you know? What kind of advice you give the next, the next man trying to come up with? You know what I'm saying? Same thing you doing, we doing. Okay. Every day, man. 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 Every
to you. Let nobody change you. You do you. Well, work for somebody else. You know, work for you. You know what I'm saying? Do you. Now he said something right there. You. 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 Remember that. You. If, it, if it's you, it's, it's originality. Yeah, and that's, that's, that's what's missing out in the music video right now, Rich A lot of that, they come out and then the, the, the young cat, they get on that one guy and they sound, everybody sounds just like that guy, man. You gotta be you. Yeah. If it ain't you, you ain't doing that. Exactly. You ain't doing that. You understand? That's how it go, man. Cause you got a lot of these stuff, you know. You might, you might, you might do about fifty songs, man. They might tell you on the spot, well, good. You know what I'm saying? That's in their eyes. They don't take one to blow up, though. Yeah. They don't take one to blow up. You can't do all the songs to have a sound just to like. You know what I'm saying? You got every song sound just to like. And I mean, you might as well just put one song. They all don't sound like that. You saying the same thing. You feel it. So, you know, so what, man? What? You got any bitch coming up in the show? I don't know, man. I'm just, I'm just right now, I'm just working. I'm just in the yard right now. And, you know, I'm just trying to, just trying to take it to the different level. You know what I'm saying? Here's a couple of open mics back in the past. You know, my folks on the page. Shout out to you, know, I'm for red. Yeah, the video shoot is just, just, yeah, I'll check it out and get those star hustles on here, too. I'll let you go. But yeah, uh, I just basically, I just, you know, once I throw this, this mix paper together, I'm just gonna put it on press. You know what I'm saying? Put it in the street. Put it in the street. Put it in the street. Make the people want it. What that boy doing? What that boy doing? Where he at? Where he at? Yeah. And I'm talking about the crowd. Well, it's up, man. It <laughs> gotta have a plan. Gotta have a plan. You got any uh, content and, um, uh, you know, what is the week to look at them and your crap? For sure, man. Y'all holler at me. I got a little YouTube channel. Uh, King Maiden. Check me out on that. I got a couple of free downloads on SoundCloud for y'all. I run it. The productions on SoundCloud. They got some nice tracks. Catch me on Facebook. King Maiden. Yahoo. King Maiden. 111982. Holler at me. I'm all over. Shout out to my nigga Jamilzo. D. Bilzo. D. Bilzo. D. Bilzo. You got a move sound to my nigga King Tut. Cut the life. Shout out to the camp squad. Fresh boy. Side. Excited for Duff. Man, Dino Infrared. AKA Unsuspected. Nigga Big Rob Rose. Shout out to the Fresh. Street Dream. Trap House. GK. Yeah, LA. Hey, shout out to everybody. Work. Hey man, appreciate you. Play the match, so man. See ya. See ya for the next video. Keep the cool on the show, man. Show, show. You know what I'm saying? Hey, this your boy D. Bill's gonna sign out, man. Remember, if you're doing you, that's originality. And that's, that's what, that's what the, the music industry missing right now, originality. So, you know, come out with you now. You feel me? Hey. Hey, this is Boy D. Bill. It ain't hard to get on the show. All you gotta do is send me a message on Facebook. Go right back on that Facebook or hit me on Twitter, D. Bills or 808. Or send me an email, go to fame 12 at yahoo.com. My number, 404-839-4518. And that's how you can read me. Hit me up. Hey, we're doing sports with me and the people's champ. So, hey, give him a look. Hey, this is your boy Mario Bell coming to you one more time with the people's champ. When we're doing sports, hey, that's another segment. So, yo, we want to talk about, I guess I guess in this segment, we're we, we, we going to start off with congratulations to the Loud Hawks. Thank you. Danny Danny Perry. Perry. Hey, GM of the year. I said it last week. I said that was a good pickup by the host for getting Danny Ferry. And you see what he did. He came in. It was almost like he was in the barbershop listening. You know, when I cut half, it was almost like he was one of the customers in here. Because he did exactly what the barbershop said. He was like, I need to get rid of Joe Johnson and Marvin Williams. 
So once again, I must, I have to do that to you, boy. Appreciate it. We got Joe Johnson going up to the Brooklyn Nets. Hey, bye-bye. Hey, hey. <laughs> salute you, baby. Hey, we were dirty. Whatever you did here, if you think you did good, hey, hey, you put that on your little resume sheet. I don't think it looked too good for you, Joe. I think your resume sheet looked real, look real shabby. You stole seven points the last game. Seven. Seven points. Last seven. game. Seven. That, 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 that don't look too good. Kobe Bryant scored like 30-something points this last game. $120 so, million. Dollars. $120 million. Dollars. The highest paid athlete. Come on, man. What they say though? Come on, man. Come on, <laughs> man. <laughs> so hey, we got him going up to Jersey with uh with Dan Williams. Oh, uh, Dan Williams. And they're waiting yeah. on your boy Dwight Howard. Dwight pretty much have everybody in limbo. Yeah. What you think you're gonna do, man? <sighs> it it knowing him is it, hard to say. He I mean New Jersey, I heard New Jersey don't want them. I mean, New Jersey got the pieces to send Orlando, but yeah. Orlando really don't want them. They got the heart. They don't want them. The trade would have been really would have been done by the All Star break. Okay, so, okay. New, uh, Orlando doesn't want what New Jersey has to offer. So uh, I tell you like this, the Atlanta Hawks, we are in position. We just got rid of Kurt Hound. We don't need him because we got rid of Marvin Williams. Yes. Yeah. What uh the guard that came from I think he was from Houston. Utah. Yeah, Devin uh, Harris. Devin Harris. So he's a pretty good guard. Along with T, that backcourt looked pretty solid. Then you have uh, your boy Josh Children along with Horford. Hey, that, that don't look too bad myself. So then we got we drafted a rookie. That's a pure shooter. Pure shooter. So we got the two guard situation squared. So all we need now is that five and fifth position. We need a center. We need a big man. And yeah. we have enough money now. The money has been cleared oh, up. Thanks to Joe Jackson, we have enough money. <laughs> you get Atlanta's own Dwight Howard. So hey. Hey, Dwight, come down here, man. Come home, man. No thank you. Don't think we ain't in the running for you, man. We in the running for Dwight Howard. And that will put the Atlanta Hawks back in contention, as they should be. And they haven't been there since Dominique with Wilkins. So hey, we're trying to get back where we used to be. So enough for the Hawks right now. I'm happy with them. Uh, they're going to be a subpar type team next year. They're not going to win the ring. They should make the playoff. <laughs> so enough for the Hawks. We're going to let them simmer because they're doing pretty good. But I have to talk about my LA Lakers. They made a move in the right direction. You think the right direction? They acquired Steve Nash. Pick and roll is off the chain right now. No, he's a big, big liability on defense. Big liability. Yeah, I mean, you know, you, you got to take big something good. You got to take something good with the bad. Uh, I, I really don't have no problem with uh, your boy Nash going at Westbrook. I think he's going to bring it to him. He's a real guard. That's the only guard we really fear in the West. But this is a Hall of Famer. We're talking about a Hall of Famer two time. MVP joined up with your boy Kobe, one time MVP, five time champion. Come on. Then you got two other all stars so far that's still on the team Andrew Bynum and your boy Mark Saul, or Paul Saul, excuse me. Mark, no, bro. Yeah, that's the little bro. We're talking about the big bro. So you got, you got four all stars on, on a five, starting five court. I like that. I hope they have some wheelchairs out there because some of them got AARP. But they're just trying to make it, they're trying to make it a little bit more comfortable for Kobe on the way out. He has uh extended he has extended his career by bringing Nash over. He no longer has to bring the ball up the court. He can just run up the court now. We got a facilitator. That's fearless. So hey. Enough for the Lakers, they are back. We must talk about Ray Allen leaving the Boston Celtics. Hmm. Ray Allen, I, I I think that's a good fit for him. Uh, out of the big three over in Boston, I think Ray Allen was the the latter of the three. I think Paul Pierce is, is, is mounted as a Celtic. And then you have Garnett that's so loyal. And, and he's old school. He has he has that built-up rival shit with LeBron, so he's, 
don't want to go there. So now it's going to be a big rival. Ray Allen going to take it? That's right. That's right. Ray Allen is a pure shooter. This will extend his career more years because mm -hmm. all, all you have to do is sit on the arc, take them shots. That was a good move for Ray Allen and the Miami Heat. I can't wait to see Boston and Miami play in this show. It's going to be good. It's going to be good. And then, you know, you have Boston. They picked up Jason Terry. The acquisition. Jason Terry is a hired gun. He's an athlete that, hey, you pick me up, I'm going in. I am going in. Hey, man, I got a call from who? Who, who, who called me? Call. What's up, man? Hey. You said what? Yeah, Cole, we need to go and be on you the show. You want to be on the show? Yeah, Cole, 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 Cole. Let's wait, let's wait, let's wait till the playoff. You will be on the show. You want to retire. You okay, retire. people chat. Come on, you want to talk to, to ne next time? Okay, I'll tell you. Right. Cole, now that was Kobe Bryant. He told me he is going to win the two top 2013 championship next year. So LeBron, look out, look out. So what else we got, man, going out here, man, in the in sports world? Oh man, uh, for people who like UFC, uh, I heard that uh, Sylvia won. He changed his title okay. once again. Okay. That's one like. 13, 14 straight. I don't know. I lost count. Okay. Boy, it's bad. But uh, he doing his thing. Um, baseball. You know, we got the All-Star game coming up. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. July 10th. The home gotcha. run derby on July 9th. Uh, no Braves in the home run derby. We got a couple of Braves doing the All-Star game. Uh, 20 years bet Chipper Jones. You know, this okay. is his last season. Okay. Um, he's still around. He's still, still around. He's still around. He's still wow. hanging in the other thread. Uh, he got voted in the last fight to the All-Star game. Guess that's good sportsmanship. Feel a bit like that. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. You got like two or three braids in the All Star game. Though. Okay. Okay. The braids, it's, it still look like they, they yeah, have no pain. Be up and down, you know. But you got a big series this weekend with the Phillies, so uh, and they're sliding, so hopefully you take advantage of it. Gotcha. Gotcha. Serena. Serena. Oh, won. Hey, my girl. Serena. She's bad, ain't she? Man, I always like her better than her older sister. Me personally, you know. That girl is bad. That girl is bad. Bad. And I mean, in all sense of and the word. And she does Bam. other stuff besides just practices tennis all the time, and she still come play tennis and dominate. Well, she is a, a, a owner, the owner of the uh, Miami Dolphins. And she had part, part, part on the show. I mean, she's Miami majority Dolphins. owner, so she, her and her sister, I commend you for, uh, hey, doing your homework and going out and being an entrepreneur outside of your own sport. I commend you on that one. So hey, I want to go back to basketball just for a second. I was asked by Blake. No, it's not. They said that Ray Allen had a little problems with your boy Ray John Rondo. Yeah. They say Rondo, Rondo had you know had some stuff he wanted to talk to him about, and, and that that had something to do with Ray Allen leaving. Oh, what, 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 what you think about that? Cuts for life. I mean, do you think Ray Allen really got pumped out by Rajon Rondo? That's what I think. So you get back with us and you let us know. You can see us every week with sports with the People Champ and Mario Bell. So hey, any comments you want to leave, leave them down in the, in the box. Because hey, we do it every week. Every week. Follow him on Twitter. Follow me on Twitter at People Champ. Hey, prototype. Let's know what you want to think about. So, hey, holler at your boy. Hey. Peace. Parents, are you looking for a fun, energetic, and affordable DJ for your child? Well, you've got her. DJ Rockabell, the children's DJ. Located right here in the Metro Atlanta area. Specializing in cool and positive music, DJ Rockabell does it all. And hey, she's not just a DJ, she's also a child advocate, promoting child rights, family values, self-esteem, and much, much more. For the month of July, you can receive $2 off each haircut by just coming in and saying, Peace. Now remember, peace. You can reach me at 668 Metropolitan Parkway in Atlanta, Georgia, in the West End community, across the street from the Metropolitan Law, right next door to the City Employee Credit Union, also the used tie shop, and Wonder Smith 
ribs and chicken. So hey, if you have any comments, anything that you want to talk about, any topics, hey, leave it down in the comment box. And you can also subscribe to The Real World Leader on YouTube. That's The Real World Leader. For booking, you can reach me at willis.bell5 at gmail. You can also reach me on Facebook at Mario W. Bell. You can follow me on Twitter at Prototype. Hey, the name of the show is Cuts for Life. Well, we go over cuts, but we also are going to give you some life issues. So, hey, mess with your boy. I'm here. Peace.